In this video, I'm gonna show you how to add a link and a PDF file so that way your PDFs are nice and interactive. I'm gonna show you two different ways how to do this. First is Canva, and then second, I'm gonna show you how to do this in pdfescape.com. Okay, so now we are in Canva. I have my file here. It was all designed here in Canva as well. And I wanna add links to all the gear that I recommend. So I'm just going to highlight this one. This is a tripod. Then I'm going to click on the three dots there click on link and then I'm just gonna paste my link right there and hit done. Now it will automatically underline what you just linked. So if you don't wanna underline, you can just highlight this again and then deselect underline up here. I also like to link my logo too. So I can just select the logo here, hit the three dots do the same thing and then paste in uh, my website. And then once you're done with all of this, you're just gonna go to share, click on download, and I do PDF standard, just because most people are just gonna open this from their computer or phone, and click on download. Then they can simply click on the links and it'll take them right there. Which, by the way, if you want this free checklist and guide on how to film yourself professionally on a phone, it comes with a free training video as well. I'll put the link in the description below. Next up, I'm gonna show you how to use PDF Escape in case you don't have Canva. So you're just gonna go to pdfescape.com and then just click on free online. And then next, just click on upload PDF to PDF Escape. Once it's uploaded, I like to zoom in, so I'm just gonna click on the plus button up here. Then I'm going to click on link. And then you can create a box over what you want to link. Then you can just paste your link in there, hit okay and go ahead and do that the same thing for all of the things you want to link up okay so once you've linked everything up you're going to just click on save and then click on the download button and it'll download onto your computer and people will be able to click on those links now if you want to learn how to actually embed a video in a PDF file using Adobe Acrobat. You can watch this video right here. Um, if you don't see it, it means you're not on the YouTube app, so I'll also put the link to that video in the description below. I'll see you in the next video.